sixth place from Eastridge, Ryan Richardson. doing something on Saturdays. It's meant getting up early and being with my friends and doing something that's going to help me with the rest of my life and doing something that's really fun and being in an activity that isn't just banned. My advice for future speechers is always remember your accessories. Watches, belts, if you're going with earrings, go ahead. And make sure you have your script because sometimes you forget a few things. Speech has just been a great outlet for like creativity and fun and friends, you know? I mean, you meet amazing people every week, you just have a blast, you lose sleep over it, so it has to be awesome. 
and it's just all around a great experience. For future people, I would just say, have fun with it. I mean, you're getting up early, you're with awesome people, just make it a blast, you know? Have fun, party. It's great. Uh, speech to me has just been completely fundamental in becoming the person I am now as a graduating senior. I mean, I met, I met all the friends that I have now through speech. I, I joined theater because of speech. I, I can't imagine where I'd be without the speech team. And I have one piece of advice for anybody who's thinking about joining or who is on the speech team. It's just, uh, you know, give it your all. You'd be surprised what you're good at. Speech to me has meant new friendships and new experiences and just an overall fun time. And the advice I'd give to other people is don't be nervous when you're going in year rounds. Other people might look intimidating, but you're obviously better. Speech to me has been one of the best decisions I could have made in high school, honestly. Um, the people that I've met through the activity, you know, the support of the coaches and everything, it's been so much fun. And it's definitely something that I'm going to miss in college. Advice that I would give to future members would just kind of be to be yourself. Um, just be open to anything, you know, if you're kind of thinking, hey, I don't know if I want to be in this category. Just stick with it, stay true to yourself, and it'll all work out in the end. Uh, speech has meant a lot to me. Speech is the way I made lots of friends at this school. Most of my friends are in speech, and I mean, you gotta love speech, kids. We're awkward, we're really weird, but that's, that's the best part about speech, and it's just being together every morning, getting irritated by the person who sits next to you, but I mean, that's... That's what speech is about, just being together and, you know, working together, helping people through their problems, anxieties. Speech is just a great activity because it just helps you get closer to people and you just feel like you feel generally loved by these people. So, yeah, uh, advice I give to incoming speech people. Practice your piece, <laughs> because if you don't practice, you're not going to excel. So you have to practice and get enough sleep, because you don't want to be sleeping during the speech meet, because then that's going to be really weird. Okay, well, uh, speech has mean a lot, because I joined speech to make friends, but I made them. I joined speech to basically talk better, and I think I talk better, and it pushes you out of your comfort zone, which in my case it did, and now I speak better and everything goes good. And then, uh, oh yeah, the advice would be wake up like two hours before, and then wake up like an hour later, so you wake up actually at the right time and you're not running all over the place. Yeah. Bye! Um. What speech has meant to me is, um, it's been a way for me to help um, break out of my shell, get a little less shy, and um, advice for future members is um, practice a whole lot. Even if you think you're good, practice more. You'll get better. So speech for me, well, speech for me means making friends and really to let your voice be heard by people. It's just about getting up there and use your voice and just to tell people what you have to say and it's it's coercive you kind of force them to listen to you and um, just really hope that they like you I guess is fact of the matter and my biggest advice for any of you out there is just you gotta have fun seriously love your piece I promise you that the moment you love your piece and have passion for it is the day when you're going to place for your peace. I just, I know that for a fact. So, that's about it.